Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Assalamualaikum and hi everyone Welcome back So in this video, we will go through three examples on how to tackle definite integral questions that involve substitution method So are you ready? Let's begin with example 1 So we need to integrate this function over here and remember that from our previous subtopic we have learned to use the substitution method the hint is to choose function that has power to be your u so, in this problem over here, notice that we can let this function in the bracket to be our u because it, because it has power 5. So, u is equal to x cubed plus 2x. So, differentiate with respect to x, we will get 3x squared plus 2. Okay, so we can bring the x to the other side. So, du is equal to 3x squared plus plus 2 dx which is functions over here so this is our u so we can rewrite this as integral of u to the power of 5 uh, and du so now my question is how about the lower and upper limit notice that 0 and 1 is actually the lower and upper limit for variable x right so now we have changed to variable u what we need to do so, for the lower limit of x, x is equal to 0. So, we just need to substitute the x into our u over here. So, substitute 0 into this equation. 0 to the power of 3 plus 2 multiply 0, we will get 0. So, this will be our new lower limit. Okay, 0. Now, how about the upper limit? So, the upper limit for x is 1. So, when x is equal to 1, u is equal to 1 to the power of 3 plus 2 multiply 1, which is 1 plus 2 is 3. So, 3 will be our new upper limit. Okay? So, now, what we need to do is just to integrate. So, integrate u to the power of 5 if is u to the power of 6 divided by 6 so it is from 0 to 3 so just substitute our upper limit first which is 3 to the power of 6 divided by 6 and then minus our upper limit is 0 to the power of 6 divided by 6 which equal to 243 divided by 2 alright now, let's try one more example. So, we need to integrate from 2 to 3 of this function. So, notice that this, this function over here has power 2. So, this will be our u. So, u is equal to x squared plus 1. So, du dx is equal to 2x. So, we can directly change our... Change and find our new upper and lower limit so when x is equal to 2 the lower limit so u will equal to 2 to the power of 2 plus 1 which is 5 and when x is equal to 3 which is the upper limit our u will become 3 square plus 1 which is 10 okay so 2x dx is actually du equal to 2x dx. So we can rewrite this integral become our new lower limit is 5. Our new upper limit is 10. And this is u to the power of 2. Our 2x dx is du. Alright, so we just need to integrate. So integrate u to the power of 2 is u to the power of 3 divided by 3. So from 5 to 10. So just substitute into the equation. So our upper limit is 10. So 10 to the power of 3 divided by 3 minus substitute our lower limit which is 5. 
So 5 to the power of 3 divided by 3. So this we will get 875 divided by 3. Alright. So let's try last example. Okay. So we have 3x squared multiply x cubed plus 1 in, in, this, in the square root. So this is also can be written as from negative 1, 1, 3 x squared x cubed plus 1 to the power of half dx. Alright, so remember our hint. This is a function and it has power half. So this will be our u. Okay, so u is x cubed plus 1. So differentiate, you will get 3x squared, which is this one. So that means our du is equal to 3x squared dx. Okay, so this is our du. Okay, so now let's change our low and upper limit. So low limit is 1. So when x is equal equal to negative 1, u is equal to, just substitute into our u, so it is negative 1 to the power of 3 plus 1, which is 0, and x is equal to 1, which is the upper limit, our u will become 1 to the power of 3 plus 1, which is 2, okay? So this one over here is also equal to integration from 0 until 2 which is our new lower and upper limit. So u to the power of half and 3x squared dx is our du. Okay, so just integrate. So this will become u half plus 1 divided by the power which is half plus 1 from 0 to 2. So half plus 1 is u to the power of 3 over 2 divided by 3 over 2 which is also equal to 2 over 3 0 2 so this is actually 2 over 3 u 3 2 okay so we just substitute our lower and upper limit. So our upper limit is 2. So 2, 3, apply 2 to power 3 divided by 2. Minus our lower limit is 0, 3 over 2. So we will get the answer for so 2 divided by 3. Okay. So, by that, that's the end of chapter 5, integration. So, here are some exercises for you to try. And so, good luck and bye-bye.